what inspired you to pursue a career in this field that's a very loving and thoughtful question thank you for asking so to answer this what inspired me to pursue a career in this field you know it's a deep seated desire to be the kind of mentor who tells the untold truths and trains on the obvious elements that many trainers or institutes often skip so this is what inspired me so now if you if you allow me to elaborate it further so my personal journey uh, began with a fascination for the human mind and its incredible potential for growth and change so i experienced the first hand transform- transformative power of nlp and hypnosis and mindfulness meditation in my own life by overcoming challenges and breaking through personal barriers so this ignited a passion within me to help others discover and harness their inner strength and capabilities and we wanted to fill in the gaps in traditional training so throughout my own training i noticed a significant gap in how many programs approach teaching so many trainers and institutes focus on the complex theories and uh, somehow uh, advanced techniques often skipping over the foundational practical aspects you know that are uh, that are kind of a common sense for people those were skipped and that are crucial for real world application also so these obvious elements such as building genuine connection understanding individual needs and creating a safe learning environment you know these are often overlooked but are vital for any effective learning and growth it is like that so we wanted to bring that in we also wanted to ensure that there are so many untold truths in in you know in these areas in our life i wanted to be a kind of a person or a mentor who isn't afraid to share the untold truths who is not insecure about that so in my experience many programs shy away from addressing the real challenges and uh, uh, nuances of applying these techniques in everyday life especially in corporate settings you know so i i aimed to bridge this gap by providing practical honest insights that empower my clients participants to not only learn but also confidently apply these skills in their personal and professional lives and i'm so happy to look back that they are doing it so beautifully uh, somehow i feel that there was a passion for empowering others because when we empower others we empower ourselves also right so uh, i believe that everyone has the potential to achieve greatness like we are not born for the mediocre life right so this is what i believe in it's just that they need the right guidance and support so by focusing on the fundamentals that others might skip personal mastery will never skip that right and sharing the deeper truths i strive personal mastery strive to be the mentor who equips individuals with the tools they need to truly transform their lives and careers you know otherwise what's the use of having a personal mastery right then practical real world approach in our practices that i used to emphasize building rapport is another thing the importance of creating those genuine connections genuine bonds uh, empathic listening like truly understanding and addressing the needs of my participants my clients uh, the tailored strategies providing uh, customized solutions that are practical and effective and successful too for my clients then ongoing support you know being there for my people as they navigate their journey offering continued guidance encouragement and whatever is required to make them upskill th- uh, themselves so basically my career in all these fields corporate training etc is actually driven by a commitment to making a meaningful meaningful impact i want to be a mentor who not only teaches but also inspires by the way of living that she herself follows you know walking the talk kind of a thing and this approach ensures that my people my participants my clients are not just trained but they are empowered to achieve their highest potential and that's the reason that me personal mastery 
all my participants we all we reflect we become and then we inspire join the tribe we are waiting for you